Hello everyone. Welcome to the series of economics in four minutes. This is Atman from Crack Economics and Statistics. In this video, we are going to discuss the idea of Fisher's quantity theory of money. Kindly subscribe to our YouTube channel to find more videos on economics, SPSS and R Studio. Let's begin with the introduction. The quantity theory of money is helpful to know the effect of quantity of money on the economy. So here we are interested to know the relationship between quantity of money and other economic variables such as price and income. Fisher in his book, The Purchasing Power of Money propounded the idea of quantity theory of money, which is also known as transaction approach. Because Fisher assumes that money works as a medium of exchange only. So here we are interested to know the effect of quantity of money on purchasing power or general price level. That is the idea of Fisher's approach. Now, what is the theory? The theory says that other things remaining unchanged as the quantity of money in circulation increases, the price level also increases in direct and proportion and the value of money decreases and vice versa. So here you can see if the quantity of money in circulation increases, the price level also increases in direct and proportion manner. The equation is MV is equal to PT. So here M is money supply, V is velocity, P is general price level and T is transaction. Now velocity is the number of times a single unit of money changes hands in an economy changes hands in economy. So therefore, M is equal to PT upon V. Now we assume that V and T are constant. We assume that velocity and transaction are constant and therefore changes in money causes direct and proportional changes in the general price level that is P. Let's take this example. If the money is doubled, if the quantity of money is doubled, the price level will also be doubled and the value of money halved. So therefore, we have the direct and proportional relationship between quantity of money and general price level. So here, if quantity of money is doubled, the price level will also be doubled. That is the idea of Fisher's quantity theory of money which shows the direct and proportional relationship between quantity of money and general price level. If you find this video useful, kindly like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel Crack Economics and Statistics. Thank you.